Yeah. I'm out at the field, right? So I'm a coach. I'm out at the field watching a, a soccer football game. Do I give out... How do I... So I, I've approached the parent. Do I give out my business card or do I give out a flyer to the parent? It's a really good question. So my answer is an unorthodox way of doing this because I used to go out there and uh, give everyone a business card. Everyone I talked to a business card, I would even give people I wasn't talking. I would just like hand them out to people. Uh, and there's been times where I've gone and I've at tournaments, like at big tournaments where there's hundreds of cars out of the field. I print out flyers and I'm putting the flyer on every single person's car. So like I've done, I've done both of those things a lot. And what I realized though, was every time I would give someone a card or a flyer, I would be waiting. So I never, there was zero way I could follow up with that person unless I gave them another business card the next time I saw them. Correct. Right. So I would, I found myself waiting all the time for people to call me or text me or email me. Mm -hmm. And that was frustrating because like I could go spend three or four hours in the parking lot, just crushing people's cars with flyers and cards and all this stuff and leave thinking, man, I'm probably going to get like 10 clients out of this. And then, you know, a few weeks go by and get like one or two phone calls. And I didn't like that because like based off of the effort I was putting into it, I, I felt like the outcome was very small. So I realized it's going to be way better for me to have a different strategy. So instead of giving people stuff, I need to talk to people and extract their phone number. Right. So imagine imagine like meeting the girl of your dreams all right and the first time you see her you're like wow like, i really want to talk to you again and then you give her a business card like she might really like you but what if she loses that business card you guys are never talking again <laughs> no all right now when that situation, like you're always going to get her number. So you can, you can follow up with her. You can call her and text her. You're in control of communication. Correct. Yeah. Same with the parent. Mm -hmm. Like I don't want to talk to somebody out of the field. Like to me, it has zero value meeting someone unless I get their phone number. Cause like, I want to be able to follow up with them immediately. Once I leave, text them, Hey, Mr. Jones, thanks so much for, for chatting with me earlier, I'd love to set up a five minute call with you to see how we can help your son. Yeah. I can't do that if he has my business card because I'm waiting for him to get back to me. And like, this is just how it is with me. If someone gives me a business card, like I, I typically throw it away within five minutes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's like, and it's annoying too. Then I have to go to my phone and put their number in. It's like, when I talk to a parent, I'd rather just say, uh, Hey, here's my phone number or Hey, uh, text me at this number right now. So I have your, so I have your phone number. Like, yeah. It's so much easier and better for the business to get phone numbers, phone numbers and emails are that that's, that's the whole business really. 